Hello everyone, welcome back to Danganronpa. I'm Karen Maku. And I'm Doom Dragon. So. I just found out that I'm getting a PS4 completely for free. <laughs> so, does that make you feel good? Yeah. Are you going to stop freaking out about the one you currently have exploding in the middle of the night? No. Okay. Um, okay, so since... Uh, so since you're in the dark about all this, let me lay... Man, I can't read. You're good. I took a sip of alcohol, and now I'm drunk. I'm surprised you didn't like it. There wasn't a whole lot of alcohol in there. Tasted like cough syrup, though. Hmm. I think you just don't like alcohol. Hmm. <laughs> Which is unfortunate for your dreams of becoming an alcoholic. I've gone through, like... Two thirds of the bottle. I know, and you're gonna drink my cup too, along with your cup. I already poured your cup into mine. I know, which means you have two cups worth worth of alcohol for this episode. Nah. Let me let me lay out what what's been going on. Let Every me lay it real with you, Chief. Everyone split. Everyone split up to investigate different parts of the building, but you see, Bianca and Taka went off on their own, and so did Kyoko. I wanted to try and find some clues on who's responsible for imprisoning us here. But unfortunately, I have made no such discoveries. That's all from me. Really? No, that's you. I'm happy if you just want to read them all. Nope. Really? That's it? Hm. If I had uncovered anything, naturally I would have had more to say, but I didn't, so I don't. So I won't, and I can't. <laughs> right, understood. Count? <laughs> Just like under his breath. Count. Okay, back to you again. Yep, let's go through her dialogue again. Uh, Taco, what, what did you uh, have to... I spent some time looking around the dormitory and... There I made a discovery of a century. I found out that there was exactly one room for each person. Well, yeah. I figured that out before anything else. Yeah. Each door already had has a nameplate on it, so I guessed all the rooms had been assigned already. What if she just huh. had the voice of the fucking, like, Game Groats busted nut thing? So she's like, yeah, I already got that. Man, all right. I, I don't know if I'd be able to keep that up, though. And each room key was attached to a chain with the owner's name precision etched onto it. Which confirms that the room I was in er earlier is, in fact, my room. Can I change her name? Or er, can I change Sakura's voice? To what? You'll see. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> and Chihiro and I found out that all the rooms are totally, like, soundproof. A soundproof. Um... I'm just acting as an echo. <laughs> She's got a backup juke. <laughs> all the rooms are soundproof. Yeah, they're soundproof. <laughs> <laughs> and they can't see her it's just a stand <laughs> my stand echo my what's it do it echoes what I say my echoes what I say my stand Candyland <laughs> why candy yeah, it's is my, that a song it's a personal joke of mine what's the joke yeah, you don't get to know because it's a personal joke <laughs> <laughs> wait is Candyland a song maybe <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like that would be like the American name for or a stand. California girls. That sounds like that would be the name, like the the American name for a stand whose name is uh, like I want candy or lollipop. <laughs> okay, let's move on. Jo JoJo is doing the thing that I hate in animes, where it has like titles of things that are just full sentences. Well, there's also that one series on Netflix that you really hate. The girl in the house across from the street from the girl in the window. Yeah. <laughs> I hate that. Your next door neighbor could scream their lungs out and you wouldn't hear a thing. <laughs> well, each room also has a private bathroom, which could... Which could... Which could also <laughs> lock. <laughs> but it's like... But it looked like there were, like, only locks on the bathroom for the girl's door. The girl's door. <laughs> <laughs> huh? But when I checked my room, my bathroom door before, it definitely seemed like it was locked. Chihiro's like, the beds are also sturdy. You could pound, you could take someone to pound town, and they would, no one would hear, and the bed wouldn't break. 
Not that I would know. <laughs> That's weird. I double checked the. I should double check that later. Hey. Okay, on. so they got a bunch of rooms ready for us. They're assuming we're gonna be here a while. Down well, better to have than not. What? Oh. <laughs> All right, fine then. Oh, I thought you were done. You got sidetracked. <laughs> That could be all. That can't be all you have to report, can it, Mr. Honors Student? It is. Got it. That's all for my report. Let's move on to whoever's next. Okay, back to you again. Yay, more dialogue. Yeah, it's split up, yuck in. It looks like uh, Leon, Hiro, Junko, and Chihiro. I want to burp. <laughs> <laughs> you get so mad when I mispronounce Junko's name. Because you want to say Junko. Yeah. It's the Junko Pop. <laughs> <laughs> I just like how upset you get. Almost as bad as clenched. We went up. Uh, we, we, uh, but <laughs> we went all up and down the school, double checking the windows and like all the hallways and classrooms. Hallways and classrooms. <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to, we wanted to see if we could like get any of those plates off the the walls. Off the walls. Uh, uh, it said come off, and I was really hoping you would say that, so I just got come. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing I caught you then. <laughs> Nothing, not a damn thing. We couldn't get a single one to budge even a little bit. <laughs> if only we had Sakura, a human muscle. What should I do? There was, wasn't any hope for escape anywhere. The school really has been totally cut off. I feel like I'm falling this into bad. despair. This sucks! Sucks. <laughs> bad, bad, this bad, bad, really bad. sucks! This sucks, 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 sucks! Suck, oh. suck, suck. Her, her, her double's like on the ground convulsing while saying suck. <laughs> no, I was thinking of like a uh, toga. Yeah? In my hero. I know. Yeah. What the hell are we going to do? Suck. <laughs> Goddamn, calm down. You're starting to make me nervous. You too, and he's pointing at the other one. It's like, suck, suck, suck. <laughs> suck, 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 suck. <laughs> okay? No, I'm not. It's hot in here. <laughs> Even, <coughs> even though I had a cold drink, <laughs> or like one sip of a cold drink. <laughs> one sip. It was uh, so gross. <laughs> really? For me, it was. I love it. I can't wait to try the other flavors. You see? I wonder if that would be any lot of flavor. The same goes to uh, Hina, Sakura, and Mondo. Celeste, Toka, and Hifumi were left, were left over, so they joined up. Sakura just bent past Mondo the whole time. He's dead now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? You okay? <laughs> we thought maybe we could find some way, some way to communicate with the outside, so we looked all over. But we didn't find a thing, sorry. Yo. I went back to the main hall, thinking maybe we could do something about that giant hunk of metal. Suck! <laughs> <laughs> I was really wanting to do that, and I was like, I need to wait for the right moment. <laughs> But even with Sakura and me both, it wouldn't budge. We hit it with desks and chairs and me and nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it was hard as, like, metal or something. Yes, indeed. Yes, well, well, yes, it is metal. <laughs> anyway, if we're gonna get out of here, it's not gonna be through there. I feel like I could cry, but no. I have to hold it in. I have to manage my hydration. My suck! St my stomach hurts. Well... From laughing too hard. From the word suck? Just, yeah. So then... I shall tell you what happened next. I flexed and the door cracked. It has nothing to do with communicating with the outside world, but it is still worth worrying about. There's no protein powder. No grow teen powder. In both the school and dorm areas, there was a set of stairs leading up to the other floor. But, but there was, there were gates there, and we couldn't find any way to open them. I was so, about to say that! So we couldn't check it out. 
Hmm. In other words, at this point, we are only able to search the first floor. However... We can further assume that there is potentially something above the second floor as well. Oh, wait. I said I was going to change your voice, didn't I? Yeah, you did. <laughs> and if that's the case... No! Well... <laughs> you're not allowed to do that one! <laughs> okay, fine. I got another one. And if that's the no, case... you're not allowed to do that one either! <laughs> There's at least a chance we may lead the way out. Uh, Do you want me to go back to Yes! <laughs> Damn it! Uh, you see. Tom? Uh, no. Let's if I'm being honest, I can't quite say we acted as one. We ran around in circles. <laughs> around a big rock that smelled real bad. Who got that joke? <laughs> it's just... It's just, they're circling the Fumi. <laughs> rather, rather, we did nothing as one. We spent the entire time in the gym. Most Honestly, we are not exactly the type to go running around a school like a gaggle of junior detectives. He oh, overcomes an I was that. Just for a minute, she peeks her head in. <laughs> like, what the hell are you talking? What are you thinking? But, <laughs> just sitting around in the gym the whole time. Whole time? <laughs> well, it's not like any of you invited me along. Nobody said, hey, come with us. Suck. <laughs> I blame you for leaving me out. It's your fault. What the? If you wanted to go with someone, you should have just said something. Something. <laughs> Forget it. Like I wanted to go anywhere with a dirty slut like you. Slut. <laughs> slut. Slut. <laughs> <laughs> your mind is just. Your mind is as thin as your body. You make me. You make me sick to my stomach. Are you for I, real? I don't even know how to react. How can How can you say something so awful to someone you just like met? Slut. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a really bad parrot. <laughs> Alright, guys, everybody just calm down, okay? All this stress is bad for skin, you know? Slut! <laughs> I forgot what voice I gave her. <laughs> you forget every time you go to her. She's so boring! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, hopefully she doesn't die first, though, then her character can adapt more. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> yeah, it sounds like you two are really close now that you're f now you're fighting like sisters. I don't think that's what's going on, Sayaka. Slut. Hey, um. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what they have to say, huh? Then I guess I'm the only one left. Slut! <laughs> I found a fridge in the back of the kitchen, and it was overflowing with all kinds of stuff. Come! <laughs> She's opening it. Oh no! All <laughs> oh, the yogurt! <laughs> oh god, it's stupid. I guess we don't have to worry about food at least. What? Sorry. Sure, for now, but even with all that, there are 15 of us. How long can the food last? Especially me! You can just eat sesame seeds or something. Man, she's a bitch and then is surprised when people get mad at her. Isn't huh? that most bitches? Yeah. What am I, a parakeet? <laughs> yeah. I don't think that we have to worry about it. All the food gets restocked automatically each day! It's How magic. do I know this? What? Uh, well, oh, at magic. least that's what, Mo that's what Monokuma said. Huh? You saw him? Slut. Okay. <laughs> we need to jump off a of slut. We need to find a new word to cling on to. <laughs> yeah, he came out of nowhere while I was checking the fridge and told me that. Then he disappeared again. He you was called me racial slurs. He was so fast. I can't believe some. I can't believe someone could have been move moving him around with a remote control! That's a weaponized toy that could just appear from nowhere? 
I can't tell if we're supposed to be afraid or not. But... But is... But is everything okay? I didn't... He didn't try to, like, eat you or anything. <laughs> eat her? Um, what do you mean by that? I mean, you say eat. What kind of eating are we talking about? Man! <laughs> what the hell, fatty? You acting like some kind of sleazy drunk dude. Actually, not like there's a good kind of drunk dude. Only high dudes. Hey, stop screwing around, all of you. Scrying. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a very bad echo. <laughs> Delayed echo. <laughs> Are you still asleep or something? We're prisoners here. We could, we could all just die at any second. Suck. Ugh, shit. She's right. We can't be making stupid jokes right now. We oh. gotta do something or... Sorry, Mondo. That's all we've been doing. <laughs> <laughs> Especially the players. The players need to be super concentrated. A voice cut through the noise, interrupting Mondo. <coughs> you're, you're all spending an... Awful lot of time yelling and carrying on. Mm -hmm. Do you really think you can afford to do so? Have none of you accepted the reality of the situation? No. Her hair is purple. Who fucking said it was silver? I'm colorblind. Yo. Kyoko, where the heck have you been? We already started the meeting without you. Oh, right, that's me. <laughs> she didn't say a word. Instead, she just dropped a piece of paper on the table. And also a monkey. Oh, what is this? It appear it appears to be a map of Hope Speak Academy. A map? What the? Where did you find this? Wow. It doesn't matter where I found it. It heck? does matter. You're really freaking us out right now. But more important. Never mind that. What's it mean? Mine. It would seem. What? <laughs> what? I said never mind. It said mind how the echo works okay just look at it the building we're in right now is laid out in precisely the same way as hope speak academy so what you're saying is this really is hope speak academy it's true well in terms of its construction yes but it looks like we, it had a number of strange renova renovations done to it renovations however i don't know all the details yet all I found was details about the first floor. Um... But then, this really is Hope's Peak. We... we didn't get kidnapped or taken to some other place. So stupid! It's not even possible! This is where the country's future elite is supposed to come in line! But... But if it really is Hope's Peak, where are all the other students? Hey, come on, guys. Let's just stop talking about all this. You know, negative stuff. He, like, breaks off a bunch of his hair. It's like, this is, like, the best joint you'll ever have. Just, just do it. Just poo it. Yo. Worried? There's nothing to be worried about. I mean, this is all planned out, right? The people in charge of Herb's Peak put this all together, right? <laughs> Man, if I got stressed every time something like this happened, I'd have ectoplasm shooting out of my mouth. You know? Good thing I got, good things come to those who wait, right? So we just gotta chill and everything will work itself out. <laughs> What's your problem? Why are you laughing? What's so funny? <laughs> I'm just I am just happy, that is all. It seems splitting up to investigate was a good idea after all. <sighs> Haven't you been listening? Looking around was a total waste of time. We didn't find a way out. Didn't you? Didn't find who's behind this. We still have no idea what's going on. Oh. Huh? Is it not crystal clear to you what's going on? Are you okay with this? It is perfectly obvious that we have been imprisoned in some secret location with no way out. None of us had any response to that. Didn't want to accept that reality, but it was star staring us right in the face. You didn't have to say to go and say that. But I was trying not to think about it. You should. N no way out. 
We're trapped here. What are we supposed to do? <laughs> it's very simple. If you want to leave, you just have to kill. Stop it! Don't even joke about that! Joke! Um... Everyone just calm down, please! We have to stop and think about what we do from here! Seems like... There's gotta be something we can do. <laughs> All we can do is adapt. Adapt to our living... Adapt to living our lives here from now on. That's... Living here? Are you sure we should just accept it? Do you understand? A lack of adaptability is a lack of survivability. That's the word, right? Yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, I do not have enough fuel in my drill horn and my drill help to get us out of the building. Starts seizing on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, survival is not based on who is the strongest or smartest. It is based on who can adapt. I would argue Actually. that. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> As someone who has come out on top more than once. Come. <laughs> come. <laughs> I have a suggestion. What? Uh, what do you mean? We all understand that we are trapped here, which means we we will be spending the night here. But spending the night, however, uh, you all remember the rule regarding nighttime, right? Yeah, yeah, we got it. We got it. We got it. Let's see. So regarding the night, this night time, I think we need to add a rule of our own. What do you mean? <laughs> Going out at night time should be prohibited altogether. The school regulations do not actually, do not actually tell us to not go out at night. I would like to make it official. Huh? But why? Are you okay with this? The way things are now, every time night comes, we will all start to get worried and anxious. We will all be afraid someone might try and come, try and kill us. Huh? What? <laughs> what? Uh, if we have, if we have to worry about that every, night after night, who knows how, uh, for who knows how long, it will wear us down in no time. I see. So you're suggesting we limit our activity at night as a kind of preventative measure? Indeed. However, unlike the other rules, nobody can be forced nobody can be forced to comply. We all have to agree to follow it. What can we do? I see what you mean, but I think I think I can agree on that. Fuck. <sighs> <clears throat> It's like the gothic, the little gothic Lolita, but the little goth Lolita said, without something like that, we're just gonna self-destruct. Self-suck. <laughs> Listen to me. On behalf of all the men here, I agree to comply. That one hurt. Why? What? You know why, you know what you did. Hey, you can't just decide to speak for us. This is fine. So everyone is in agreement? Good. <laughs> then if you'll excuse me. Huh? Huh? Wait, where are you going? Let's see. It is it is almost nighttime. I would I want to take a shower before it arrives. I hope you so are. So goodbye. Woo. Woo. Moving with Per Elegant, Celeste left the dining hall. I'm a little I only have like three glasses, I'm not drunk. Yes you are. No I'm not. Her behavior seemed so natural. I couldn't imagine anyone even trying to stop her. That Mondo kicked her feet out from under her. <laughs> Just falls flat on her face. So I guess it's pretty obvious where we go. Where we go from here, we'll be spending the night. It looks like my eyes are little mouths. Adaptability. So, Mr. Chairman, what's next? One person already left. Stop. If I can't think of anything funny she says in the sentence, I'm just going to default to sucker slut. Um. <laughs> well then, what say we call an end today's, to today's meeting? You like she said, it's almost night time anyway. We can, we can reconvene first thing tomorrow morning. Huh? Do we ha really have to stay the night? Uh, stay the night here? What can we do? We don't have a choice. We can't go for long without getting some sleep. Long stuck. So we just have to give up. 
Okay, the, I don't know about the Echo Man. I don't, I don't know if it's going to stay. Yeah, I think the Echo bit is pretty well worn its, worn its welcome. <laughs> <laughs> That's all fine and good for today. But what do we what we do tomorrow? It's going to suck because that character is so going to be around forever. So, like, we're going to remember the Echo bit eventually, I guess. I guess. Our only option is to split up and look around again. And let everyone know if we find anything. Yeah, okay, let's do that. Aww. Sakura, like, walks through a wall and leave a hole perfectly shaped like her. That we're done for today? Good. I'm exhausted. With heavy movements, everyone headed off to their private rooms. Um... I already forgot her voice again. <laughs> Maketa! Are you ready to call it, call it a day? Yeah, let's go. Yay! I'm back in my room. Yay. 25 minutes of nothing. Is this really where I'll be staying for the foreseeable future? Oh, that's right. I should check out the bathroom one more, t one more time before I go to bed. Only the girls' bathrooms should have locks on them, right? Monokuma pops out. I thought you were a girl. I mean, look at you. You don't look lo much like a man. Where's your penis? Show it to me. Show it to me. If you don't show me your penis, you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's open it up. Riddle rattle. It's no use. It really is locked. Bzzz. Wrong. Not locked. Ah, oh, Jesus, fuck. <laughs> Jeez, talk about an overreaction. It's like you just saw a ghost or something. Like some kind of robot bear ghost. I'm only one of those things. What are you doing here? What? Makoto Naegi! This is super duper majorly bad! So bad it's almost magical! Ultra magical awful awful attack! Like throws a uh -huh. fistful of sand into his eyes. <laughs> in, point in, in point of fact, I acknowledge that the bathroom in your room has a problem with the door frame. Wait, so the reason it won't open isn't because it's locked? The door just doesn't fit? Hey, Didn't you um... see the notice? What? Can't you read? The bathroom in the boys' rooms don't have locks. Yeah. I mean, a lock in the boys' bathroom is kind of pointless, don't you think? Well, it's not that pointless, I guess. But I'm no expert on the birds and the bees and all that. Listen anyway, there's a little trick to opening this particular ill-fitting door. And that's what I'm here to teach you! Birds and the bees! Let's do this! The man sticks his pionius! <laughs> okay, ready? So you just gotta turn the doorknob and then lift up while you pull! It's like with your penis, you know? And then you insert it in the cloaca, I think! <laughs> so listen, we all know the man pees during sex, but let's talk about where he pees! <laughs> Go ahead, give it a try! <laughs> Turn the knob and lift the door up while I pull. Uh, when when I did that, the door opened without a problem. I should have time when I used to do that with my door. Pee on it? Yeah. Damn, man. No, right? I'm sorry, you didn't have a bathroom. See, it opened right up. Isn't that crazy, though? Your door is the only one that doesn't fit quite right. You're supposed to be the ultimate lucky student, right? But looks like you're not lucky at all! Bye-bye! <laughs> anyway, I suddenly don't feel like being here anymore. Bye! And then he explodes. He pops. Hey, wait! Damn it. Dingy me. Uh, school announcement. <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. Gross. <laughs> As such, it is officially nighttime. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. What if I'm already in there? Fuck you! Like, if, if entry beyond that point is prohibited, if I'm already in the dining hall, I'm technically not breaking any rules. Yeah, but fuck you. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Oh, bite as much as I want. I'll bite you then, stupid! 
You hear him running down the hall. <laughs> <laughs> it lo- looks like it's nighttime. We all promised we wouldn't leave our rooms now. Uh, the, you read the white ones, I read the blue ones. Okay. All I can do now is try to get try and get some sleep. While still mumbling to myself, I collapse on t- uh, into the bed. <laughs> My eyes closed almost immediately. It's not like I was ready for bed exactly. I was just utterly exhausted. Uh, In other words, ready for bed. <laughs> you know, the exact definition of being tired. Uh, it was as if I'd spent the entire day staring at the TV watching movies. Or, like, some kind of illusion where I had been tossed into a made-up fantasy world. Yeah, that feels about right. (laughs) There's no easy way to just accept the situation we've suddenly been dropped into. Bye. Bye. So this is how the curtain closed on my first day to Hope's Peak Academy. Soon enough, I was asleep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. (laughs) Whoa, whoa, whoa. Would it be too much to hope that when I woke up, I'd realize it was all a dream? (gasps) Wait! (laughs) It's kind of lame as far as endings go, but I'd be fine with that. Actually, that'd be the best. Yay, Monokuma Theater! Yay! In any normal school, Mr. Monokuma would be a kind teacher, but when I think about what's coming up... I'm just so full of pride and joy. Our ceremony earlier today was absolutely splendid. Thank you all very much. Remember you remember that you're all students at Hope Peak, Hope's Peak Academy and strive to refine your ideals. I swear to you, I will send you all off into a new tomorrow. Thank you. Okay, we should probably end the episode. Because it's like, it's been 30 minutes. Yeah, it's been. Do you want to let Monokuma finish? Well, no, because like fucking. All right, ladies and gentlemen. That has been Danganronpa. Rampa. <sighs> I hope you guys are enjoying this. 70 episodes, Dangan Rampa confirmed. Uh, it's going to take us at least 80. I'm calling it now. I'm betting 100. <laughs> Uh, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, if you liked it, you know, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. It really helps us out. And we will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody. Good night, ladies and gentlemen.